Happy New Year's, fellas. In today's video, I'm going to take you through a clean and squat workout that reveals the four most important kettlebell clean variations that you must learn to become proficient in if you want to be able to use kettlebells to their full and utmost potential. Why are these four variations pivotal for getting the most out of your kettlebells? Besides providing strength and explosiveness via powerful hip extension at different levels, based on where you initiate each one of the cleans from, either from the ground or the hang position, they also allow you to safely and more efficiently perform exercises in both the rack and overhead position. Think about it. Unlike a barbell that can be set in a rack and unracked to perform, let's say, front squats, overhead presses, or overhead squats if you're feeling squirrely, to perform any kettlebell exercise in either the rack or the overhead position, your first objective is simply getting them from the floor to the position that they need to be in to initiate that lift itself. And in this clean and squat workout, I'll take you through a complex of four different variations, the hike, the power, the hang, and the goblet that you must master in order to be able to safely utilize kettlebells to the utmost of their potential. And although each are different in where they're initiated from, the how is actually pretty similar. They each require you to keep your core tight and shoulders packed, meaning scapula depressed and shoulders externally rotated so your elbows are tucked in and lats are activated, and drive the movement via powerful extension of your hips. That's for initiation of the movement, for catching the kettlebell softly so they don't hammer the top of your forearms. Just remember the cue to pull back and punch through the handle. Prioritize these form cues, get some volume in with controllable weights, and over time you'll safely be able to progress to moving heavier weights into the rack position and perform more aggressive movements either in the rack or overhead position. Now, enough talking, let's get the film rolling on today's kick-ass kettlebell clean and squat video.
Hey guys, thanks for checking out today's video. If you enjoyed it and want more, then do me a solid by hitting the thumbs up button and subscribing to the channel so you don't miss out on any of the videos I hook you up with here every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And if you're looking for a more in-depth view of exactly how I program for all of my clients who are short on time yet hungry for some serious gains in performance and aesthetics, then start by grabbing your free copy of the Kettlebell Cardio Blueprint I've put together for you by clicking on either the book image you see right over there to the right or the pin link at the top of the comment section down below. This free guide has a week's worth of my sub 10 minute home workouts, my top 10 rules for losing fat without losing size or strength, and my plug and chug workout builder to help you design fast and effective routines of your own from the comforts of your home. So to grab it for free, just click over there or down there and I'll take you directly to the download page which allows you to access it immediately. Appreciate your time, guys. Have a good one. Mandler, out.